Our first honoree, Marley Dias, is proof positive that you can be a change maker at any age. At the wise old age of 13, <laughs> Marley is the founder of an international movement to collect and donate children's books that feature black girls as the lead character. That movement is a thousand black girl books. Marley is also the author of the widely popular Marley D Gets It, Marley D Dias Gets It Done, and So Can You. In addition to being a movement builder, Marley is editor in residence of her own digital zine, Marley Mag, on L.com, which has garnered, check this out, over six billion media impressions. That's right, I said six billion. B. Marley has appeared on Ellen, CBS This Morning, The Today Show, and has interviewed the likes of former Secretary of State Hillary Clinton, who often tweets about her, as well as Ava DuVernay. Marley is a 21 under 21 Teen Vogue ambassador and the youngest member of the Forbes 30 under 30 list for 2018. There is so much more I could say about Marley. I will quote a refrain from one of my favorite Alicia Keys songs, which is so appropriate to describe Marley. This girl is on fire. <laughs> Here's a short video that captures the magic of Marley Dias. So for me, it was reading. But for a lot of kids, it's singing, it's dancing, it's basketball, swimming, painting. And we want to show them that who you are and the place that you come from and the things that are unique to you as a child make you a change maker and they help you help help you help so many other people because no matter what with my story because I care so much about reading I'm able to go out and speak to so many more kids because they connect with my passion they connect with the fact that I love what I do unconditionally and I want to show to kids that there is a power in who you are and that we need to grow that through our community through social media through our style through, our, uh, through activism and through recipro uh, reciprocity and being reciprocal to our community. All right. Please welcome 2018 McSilva honoree, Marley Dias. Hi, everybody. I'm Marley. Thank you so much for this great award. I'm grateful to the McSilver Institute and, and ten, to NYU for honoring my work and considering me a vanguard for social justice. Just so everybody knows, I'm wearing heels today, so I'm really tall. I'm like looking down, but I'm trying my best. So for those of you who don't know me, I'm Marley Dias, and I'm interested in creating a new knowledge about the roots and causes of inequities. My work focuses on equity and inclusion, particularly in children's books and with educational systems. I work each day to create spaces for black girl stories to be heard, understood, and shared, because I believe that all of us need to see ourselves. When we see ourselves in books, it increases the chance that we will read. I started my hashtag 1000 black girl books campaign because of the intentional exclusion of black girl stories from assigned readings in schools. The same amount of energy it took to exclude us, I'm giving back to make sure we are included. I do this work, thank you. And I do this work because I believe that black girl stories like black girls lives matter and they matter every single day. Not including our stories is unjust. I believe that if we make space for black girls, it will open up the gates and doors for others. I'm a champion for black girls because, you know, I am a black girl. But my work is about all of us. In the same way that we know we must all work together to reduce ignorance and increase equity, we all must be champions for black girls. When black girls succeed, we all succeed. And I mean, that's the truth. I wrote that in my notes, but I could say that off the top of my head, where that's the truth. Being honored here tonight means a lot to me because both of my parents, my mom's here today, and my brother, you know, actual brother, my, my mom's assistant, Kent, who is a TA, so he's great, uh, by the way. But my parents uh, were born poor, and today they work to increase economic and social opportunities for others. My mom's life is devoted to increasing well-being of women and girls, and my dad works to build supermarkets and food deserts for Wakeford. Though I don't say it all the time, my work is about serving people like my family. 
I believe we must all be champions for those with fewer and worse opportunities. And that means we must focus on girls. Girls and women are often ones with fewer chances to succeed, to be healthy, or to be themselves. And too often, black girls are the ones who are forgotten. I want to make sure that we are remembered and celebrated. However, we cannot achieve economic freedom without freedom of our minds and our spirits. With the help of my family, friends, and with you all, I have achieved great things. What I love about the name Vanguard is that it means the whole. And I'm at the forefront of this issue, but I'm not the magical exception. I'm one of several girls who are learning how to use our skills and talents to make a difference in the world. I can be the norm if we invest in girls, if we put our time, our energy, our love, and our resources into growing girls and developing them. With support, lots of love, and resources, I'm happy, and I can speak my mind and change the world. I ask you tonight to help me with my work towards making us all be able to be the change we wish to see in the world and be the main characters of our lives. Let's all break barriers to change systems. Let's all make spaces for all voices to be heard and for all people to be included. Let's all make the effort to change what we want to see in the world. If I, Marley Dias, 13 years old, can get it done, then so can you. Thank you again. Good night.